So today I'm going to be just showing you guys how I get ready for like an everyday type occasion. I don't know. Um, honestly, every day I don't look as fabulous as I do on YouTube. If I look fabulous, you guys, at all. Um, Vaseline. Y'all draping. Y'all see me draping though? Honestly, my makeup really isn't that much. The prime objective for everyday makeup is to protect my skin, make sure it looks decent, presentable, Ow. presentable, and make sure it's moisturized. Um, if I drop this one more time, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna mix some primer. This is the Pore Perfecting Primer uh, from Tarte, the Cleanless Clean Slate Primer. I'm gonna use some of my MAC Luster Drops for just a shiny, a tad bit of shine because I'm not gonna use any highlighting powder. Face and Body Foundation. And because the climate that I live in now is super dry, I can wear makeup that isn't, um, that isn't matte finish. Sometimes I don't even do all of this. This is for if I wanna look really good. <laughs> and of course, some of my CK1 foundation because it's my fave. And I put all that on the back of my hand. And I'm gonna take a brush and slap that on. I'm just gonna work that into the skin really quickly, nothing fancy. And sometimes guys, if I'm wearing a wig or a hat that day, which I'm probably gonna do today, I don't even put anything on my forehead. Like I leave my forehead completely makeupless. And I just like, don't even worry about it. Like this half of my forehead, I don't even touch it. Um, I'm just gonna fill in my brows lightly. I haven't got my brows done. And I don't even know how long and it's really making me sad. So I think that I'm gonna break and go and get my eyebrows done. And I mean, y'all can't really tell like, cause I mean, I put concealer and stuff on them and then filters and things like that. But you guys, my brows are so terrible. Like there's so many hairs that are growing in places that don't need to be. So I'm just lightly filling in my brows with Anastasia Dip Brow in Dark Brown went up a shade because my hair is not as dark even though I'm gonna be wearing a wig but I still don't like for my brows to be super black when my hair isn't dark so this brow is really ruthless and that's why I never fill it in good I always have to go back with concealer and fix it and I hate using concealer when it's just a normal day and I don't care you know but my brows are not on fleek so gotta do what you gotta do. And my Graftopian concealer, I'm almost out of. Look how much I've used. And I'm gonna just fix my brows just a tiny bit. Oh, that's too much concealer. But whatever. And my outline. And then if I have any gaps, I'll go back and fill them. I move quickly enough this look usually only takes me about 10 minutes take my LA girl pro concealer cuz it's basically everything to me and I'm gonna just put that on places where I usually highlight and I'm gonna buff that out with a brush like this mocha and contour just a little bit and I like doing this instead of using a powder because that way it sits underneath my, my powder um, underneath my powder that I'm gonna blend everything out with kind of 
just help. I'm just slapping this on, like I'm not doing this really like precisely. It's my little contour that I got going on. Okay, I'm gonna blend it out. And then I'm gonna blend that out some more. This is my mineralized powder in tan, dark gold. I'm just patting that all over. So taking my mascara off is never really the fun part of removing your makeup. But I'm gonna go ahead and put some mascara on anyway. Um, Cause like I said, today we're, we're trying to look cute today. We want, and I want my eyes to look open. I feel like I look really tired for some reason. So. Ugh, I always get mascara everywhere. It's so annoying. I annoy myself. And I always like brush out the front of my brows just so they don't look super harsh in the front. Makes them look more natural. So, um, about this hair. I'm not about to wear my hair in this little this little karate chop ponytail that I got going on. Um, but I am going to make it a little bit tighter just so that it stays throughout the day, hopefully, I'm hoping, um, so that I can put a wig on top. So I'm going to put on a wig cap, ow, and put a wig on, put a hat on top of that, boom. I think this is my wig from Wow African, yeah, it's my Wow African wig, and uh, I'm just going to put that on. I'm not even gonna part my hair and line the part up or anything because I just don't even feel like doing all that. And I just put on a hat. This hat is from Juicy Couture. My mom got it for me a long time ago. So please don't ask about it because you ain't gonna find it. Actually, I don't like wearing lipstick like on a normal day. If I do wear something, it'll be like a lip liner so it doesn't come off. But I'm not really even trying to wear lipstick. I'm really not. I think I'm just gonna do some 902C, just a little bit though. Like a dab. This is the closest thing to my real lip color. Yeah, it's gonna come off anyway, so it don't matter. But yeah, so peace out. <laughs>